Hi guys, you guys are here for part two of the IELTS listening exam. We've got a really good one for you today. I'm Michael. And I'm Phil. And you're watching the IELTS Grunt. Remember to like and subscribe. Yeah, so we've got a few of these practices on the channel already, but today we're focusing on part two. Mm -hmm. We're going to give you the questions that you can look at and use your skills of prediction in order to predict the answers that you might have to uh, listen out for. Then you're going to listen to the track, you can listen to it as many times as you want, although in the exam you only get to listen once. And then after that, we'll reveal the questions to you. So uh, tell us about the first step. So that first step, you guys need to look at the questions very carefully. And you guys need to find the keywords. These are the things that you will be listening for. And then also making predictions using your grammar knowledge, your vocabulary and collocation knowledge, and any background knowledge and logic. Yeah. Really, really important step there. It can save you uh, from getting distracted, basically. OK, and uh, we're going to do that now. You should see the questions appearing on screen about now. All right, guys, so now that you guys have had some time to look at the questions, it is time for the listening. Remember, the first time you listen, you should use one color, and if you listen again, you should use a second color. Again, this is because on the real exam, you've got one chance. Yeah, and you want to know what you're hearing the first time, yeah. Okay, so let's go into that and listen to that track. Good morning, I'm Philip Michaels, and I'm in charge of HL. We're super excited to have you here, and I hope that you all find the next four months a time of growth and fun. I'll be first giving you some general advice about being an intern. For most of you, this is your first job working in an office environment, specifically in our field. As a result, you may find the first week or so quite challenging. You'll be learning a lot of things, so while you won't be expected to remember everything, you should be taking good notes. You all will find that you are not just getting us coffee or taking notes in meetings. You hold a position that is integral to our workflow and success. With this in mind, please ask one of our more experienced staff if you don't know what to do or get stuck. They won't mind, as they had been in a similar situation when they started their careers. If you don't ask, you won't learn. And isn't that why you're here? We're going to be rotating you all through a number of different departments to maximise your experience here over the next two months. Get to know the people in each department well, as you will need to rely on and work with them regardless of where you end up during the second half of your internship. As well as having a direct manager for each department, you will also have a mentor. This is a person who you will go to for any problems that you may find adjusting outside of the technical problems you may find in each department. Remember, for those, you should be going to the direct line manager. Your mentor will be guiding you through weekly meetings and they'll help you identify what milestones you've achieved so far, in addition to any areas where you may still need to improve. We found this to be immensely important for motivation, as interns who didn't have this aspect of the program usually either thought they were doing great when they weren't, or weren't able to recognise their successes. With this in mind, don't disregard what your mentor has to say despite their youth. All right, guys, it is time for the grand finale. The answers! Yes, but if you're not quite ready for the answers, you can always go back and listen again. But the answers are appearing on the screen in one, two, three, ta-da! <laughs> All right, guys, so hopefully you've enjoyed this video, you found it a useful practice. We have lots more videos like this coming up, and if you don't want to miss out, then you should be sure to subscribe to the channel and hit the notification bell. It's really gonna be worth your time. By the way, speaking of subscriptions, we also have a newsletter that you can subscribe to. The link is right down there if you wanna get a tip every week. And uh, if you have enjoyed the video, then why not give us a like? It really does help us out. So thanks very much for watching, and we'll see you in another video very soon. Peace.